Well, hello and welcome to Kimber Bushcraft. Today I'm making a little video out from my camp. And as you saw in the beginning, I have leveled out the floor here in, the, in my shelter. Uh, I put a little uh, log and uh, fill it up with uh, first uh, soil and then sand. 
and the sand is because then it is a little bit more fireproof if sparks are going down on the floor the sand it won't, won't ignite I think that's a good idea and uh, the, also the other reason is now you, uh, you can lay on the floor it's uh, completely uh, level so uh, when my uh, good friend Johnny comes he has a choice between the hammock as you saw in my previous video and laying on the floor on the uh, air mattress so uh, two choices for him and uh, I think I'll have other people out here uh, for our own night and then I have uh, plenty of room for that so that is so nice it was hard work really hard work especially the sand uh, wet sand always is heavy and I had to carry it uphill and uh, well you can see I'm sweating still but now I'm finished have you ever thought about this what this is for well I can tell you this is a clue yeah that's right some of you probably have guessed it it's for my drinking horn isn't it cool I think it's so great and uh, I can take it up and drink and put it down without this one is uh, turning over so I found this in India actually on the internet and of course I put a link uh, below so you can find it and uh, perhaps you would like to buy it too I think it's so cool it's a uh, uh, handmade forged uh, iron and um, well it has a nice shape and it fits perfectly uh, down uh, my drinking horn uh, fits perfectly down here so now I'm only going to uh, take this beer it's a beer from Denmark Svaneke from Bornholm I think as I have uh, shown you this before Bornholm was the island where my sister and brother-in-law is living and I was on vacation there uh, last summer a little wonderful island in the Baltic Sea so now I'm going to open this and well I think it's a well-deserved drink after my hard work it's a black beer a stout uh, that's the beer I prefer the most I love uh, stout beer I don't know if it's called that in English but here in Denmark we call it stout skull everybody Mmm. Oh, so good. And again, one of my very friendly uh, subscribers have sent me this a little gift. It's a fair rod uh, attached to a piece of antler. I don't know if he has made it himself, but it's really cool and very old school. I love it very much. And it's Thomas Cole. Uh, thank you very much, Thomas. I will uh, probably make a, some kind of sheath for this 
so I can have it uh, perhaps on my belt kit or on my rucksack. I'm not sure yet, but it's a very big uh, ferret and a big a piece of antler. I'm so grateful. Thank you very much, Thomas. It's great. I love it. And I just want to show you uh, my Finnish cookster with the attachment, my claw and tooth for a, from a bear, and my little uh, Viking tooth hammer. Uh, I'm actually not going to make a cup of coffee today because it's too late. I'm going home, but of course uh, I'll have my whiskey with my little wink. Uh, a video from me without this uh, is not a, a real thing. So I have this little cup, a uh, little kuksa I bought in uh, Norway uh, some years ago. And um, I just pour my whiskey into that. Skål. Well, this is all for now, folks. I hope you enjoyed this little video of my uh, proven in my Kimber Camper shelter. I think it's nice now I can have people uh, sleeping out here on the floor if I want that. And uh, it's uh, a little bit more fireproof when I have my uh, bushcraft, essential bush box in here. So, thank you again for watching Kimber Bushcraft. I really appreciate that. And I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye bye. Take care, school. Mm.